Kevin, <clears throat> Mark, uh, big, big night for you on Saturday. Uh, hopefully it's going to launch you to the, the, the general public. Yeah. It's on a, a massive platform which everyone's going to be watching because Tyson Fury returns. Yeah. And you've got a good opponent, a good British opponent with a name, someone that you've yeah. wanted and he's bringing something to the table with a title. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, this is what I want, the title fight. It's now uh, going to bring the best out in me. Looking forward to it. Well, I was just talking to Kevin before, and I know you can't look past this fight, but you know, if everything goes the way you, you want, you know, there's some big titles out there and some big fights to be made, and I think they're all possible to make quickly, you know, because we were just talking, um, Liam Cameron is the Commonwealth middleweight champion, you've got uh, Jason Wellborn, the middleweight champion, and I presume these two guys are guys that you'd be chomping at the bit to, to get in the ring with. Yeah, definitely, man. Get this one out of the way on Saturday, I don't want to look past it. And then um, they're the other the fights that I want, and looking forward to it, yeah. Because you've got a perfect record, it's 19 wins, 19, sorry, 19 fights, 19 wins, 15 KOs, but realistically, this is your first real big, big name opponent, isn't it? Yeah, I wouldn't really say it was much better than Lewis Taylor, do you know what no, I mean? No, no, yeah, sorry, I'll um, take them. I, think, uh, I think Lewis Taylor would beat him, do you know what I mean? If they did fight, but, um, yeah, uh, it's going to be a good test, mate, it's going to bring the best out of me. No, yeah. Yeah, can't wait for it. And Kevin, he's returned back to you because he's been wandering all over the place training at different gyms and uh, he's back with you again now, so how are you finding it? Yeah, people say that about Mark, that he's been all over the place, but he hasn't really. We, we've been together now for about four years and we've had a lot of people that have done stuff with us and helped us out and things, but we've always been together. Um, we've been together now for well, over four years now and it's something that's worked and we, 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 we work well together and uh, we're now starting to be able to show people what we've been doing for the last few years and everything that I've been telling people about him, people start seeing now on Saturday night. Now yeah, and that's it, I'd say this is the platform for that to happen, isn't it? I mean, because I think BT, this is the, the show that hopefully this is going to launch this platform on, on, on a massive scale and start challenging the Sky Shows. Well, we've just had word this week as well, we've had a, a nice bit of news that the, the fight's been upgraded. We're actually now fighting for the WBC International, which is now a much more prestigious belt. Right. It's a 12 rounder now from a 10 rounder. So that's been a, a nice boost for us, sort of give Mark a, a high world ranking. So the fight on Saturday now means even more. Which means that if you come through this, you win this, as we, we hope you will, then suddenly, you know, even bigger doors could open. Absolutely. All right, lads, well, listen, good luck for Saturday night, and hopefully I'll be chatting to you and you'll be 20 and 0. Thanks, Lee. Take care, lads.